Match Day 17, Rich County 2, Secrets County 1. Wow, that was uh, a game that got 9.5 out of 10. <laughs> you were conned. Pairs United 1, Castle Villa 0. Arkley Rivers 2, Casardis Town 0. Hyrule Wanderers 0. Rifton United 3. Sparta United 1, Valston Albion 0. Mute City 1, Tellius Rivers 1. Oakvale Wanderers 2, Viridian Forest 0. Raccoon City 3, Port Town 0. Canlave City 2, Seoul City 2. Dawnstar United 1, Pallet Town 0. So, yeah, we've got a win uh, from a 65th minute game and not a draw. Which is um, amazing because I thought you had draw written all over that. Or oh, defeat, you know. See, Crest County dropped down to fifth there after that. But that, that's a mess, isn't it? You know, how can it be that your stats are so important in PES 2016? The whole game's built around stats. And, you know, so you sign players and you keep them and you gel them together. And stat-wise, you're better than your position. And your teamwork stats are the same because the teamwork stat for the team that I put out and that Seacrest County had out there was 96 apiece. And I had home advantage. So basically, it came down to whether my players were better than Seacrest County. And, well, duh, I signed some good players. So, yeah, we were. Um, and it's just like they were just moving so fast because, obviously, Derby match in Impulse 2016 and so in 17. <laughs> you should imagine, because, hell, that plays the same. Uh, Derby match in 2016 means that they get stat boosts. So they're faster and they're better than they should be. And they're better than my players. So it's like, what's the point? The whole point of Pez is dysfunctional. You know, is 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 irrelevant. It's broken. Just like Forza Motorsport. It's like, you know, like I've, I've been saying. You know, in Forza Motorsport, the idea is that you build and you tune your car. And each car can be built to a certain specific class. But yet the cars can be glitched. So they can get power to exceed their class. But still, be, so you can get like a car that's a C-class car, for example, but it's glitched. So it's got more power than a C-class C -class car should have, but it competes in that bracket so nobody else can touch it on the leaderboards. Well, your whole game is broken then. Just like PES 2016, but both games got apparently 9 out of 10, you know, best fours, best fours are ever, best PES ever. And they couldn't tell us that it was just broken. Because that match that I just played, that Seacrest County match, was broken. But, you know, hey, 9 and 9.5 is an advert. And they can put it on their games and they can say 9 and 9.5. And good people go, oh, that must be good. Have some cash. You know, well, yeah, I've done that. I've been conned. But I'm not being conned anymore. Get the word out. Spread the word. You know. Your nines and your nine point fives—they they, they don't tell you about broken shit, and they should do. This is a report on the development of your players. Hike Ford is improving dramatically at the moment! Exclamation mark! Jump has increased to eighty-three! Exclamation mark! Stamina has increased to ninety! Exclamation mark! Overt OPR has increased to eighty! Exclamation mark! Filtazino's OPR has increased to 73! Exclamation mark! B and Bolo's OPR has increased to 82! Exclamation mark! The cheating has increased to levels beyond off the chart! Exclamation mark! So what? 12,244,260 power alarms in the kitty! An offer for Jairi Quinner has been received from Atletico Paranaen... Uh, uh, what? What's your job? You read it. Paran... Ancy. Paranaen... From that team there. Oh, right, so... Okay, team news ahead of the Dawnstar match, which is a league match. It's not a cup match or anything. We're still in the PU league for this one. But we're away. At their ground, they have a teamwork stat, as you can see, of 77 with what's on their graphic. And they don't look too accomplished, do they? When you look at their squad, you think after four seasons, they're still a bit crap. 
Um, you know, I, I don't think they'll change it for PES 2017. I don't think teams will be structured. I don't think they'll have a purpose. I don't think that they'll try and improve their squad. I, I just think it'll just be random crap like this. I do. Um, I, d I don't think that actually the in development PES has a direction. I, I, I just think all they think is just get it out, you know, um, make sure it gets good reviews <laughs> and uh, make some money. I don't think that they actually have a purpose or a structure or where they see football, this as a football game. I don't think there's any any football flavour to PES whatsoever. I just think it's um, football is a vehicle that they've used in video game terms to get cash from. Um, certainly if I was, you know, trying to make a, a video game that was to do with football, I would actually try and get a flavour of football and I would have a an order and a structure to my football game programme that would give the player, you know, more of a flavour of a season uh, than just random crap like that. After four seasons, that's rubbish. <laughs> you know, AI teams should have a purpose. They should have a direction, in my opinion. Um, anyway, anyway, uh, this match comes not very long after our derby match, but my players should be in, you know, decent condition because for the first half we could just stand there and do sort all, as you saw. Um, so there's not really a lot of tiredness. Rob McNally will be a change. And obviously Cruz Caprock will be a change, but as you can see, you know, we'll have a decent strength squad to put out no matter what. I shall see you for that match. Take care.